Why do we create? Because we have to. Because we're driven to. It's in our blood, it's in our veins to have this urge to make some sense of things. To understand what makes us who we are, what gets us up in the morning, what makes us dance, what makes us cry. What do we love? What are we driven for? So we sing, we write poems, we draw pictures in the clouds, we design clothes, design buildings, we build brick by brick to create teams, and teams create businesses and connections and relationships. We make shoes, we make concerts, drinks, food, pyramids, airplanes, photos, flowers. We create what we love. It's a reflection of who we are and what we want to feel. And what we create it makes others feel. And to share that feeling is what makes us human. It makes us grounded in our roots. It reminds us that where we live is beautiful, and that we ourselves are beautiful. To create is to love. That's what we're driven for. share, develop empathy, soak up all the things we can. We have to take risks, put yourself out in the deep end and learn how to swim. To realize that there's no path until you walk it. To be enthusiastic about who you are and what you do. To share a story, to be vulnerable, to gain understanding, to learn how to swim. Because we have to. We have to try to understand one another, find new stories, diversify our perspective. It's what makes life exciting and fresh. We need creators, artists, engineers, and everyone in between to express themselves. Well, what's the point? We have to, we need to create. It's not about the success, or the fame, or the money, or the views, or the likes. To truly create is to love yourself and to love on others. To connect on a level that we can't live out. We create to bring us down to earth, to be truthful and honest. And remind us why we're alive in the first place.